Hey, good morning, everybody. Today is Wednesday, February the 1st, 2017. My goodness, how this month is flying. Well, January flew by. Yeah, I'm one that, uh, well, I'm alone through the days. You know, I think and I ponder about different stuff. And I don't know, maybe that's my way of keeping my mind occupied. Um... You know, I think about all the different things and how my life has changed and where I wanted to go. Um, I'm pretty happy with the way it is. Of course, you know, I have my good days and my bad days because I suffer from depression. And, you know, people all the time say, well, snap out of it. Do this or do that. It's not that easy. Um, you know, I have the life now that I've always wanted. I have two, uh, stepkids that I'm raising as my own. Um, I have a husband that I love dearly. He gets on my nerves sometimes, but who don't? But, uh, you know, and I'm trying to, uh, deal with my weight loss. You know, I had the weight loss surgery, and... It worked really well for me. Of course, you know, I've had the typical complications that everybody else gets. But um, I'm pretty happy where I'm at right now. I've been trying to, um, <clears throat> well, I ain't going to lie and say so much fall on the keto diet because I can't do it. Uh, of course, you know, I've cut out carbs. I don't eat any bread. I do not eat pasta. If I eat... Um, rice which is very rarely it's a very small amount uh so i'm pretty much trying and i'm not eating any sugar if i do take any sugar it's very very little um uh, i had found these um uh i guess you call it a protein trail mix something from walmart is i forget the name of it but anyway it's got a mixture of uh walnuts sunflower seeds and some dried uh, thanks papaya and almonds and I can eat some of that and oh my goodness it really uh, helps me as far as like if I you know feel hunger coming on or a low blood sugar but uh, you know they're like a dollar ninety eight but you know what they're really good and I don't have uh, any uh dumping syndrome or anything after eating us so that way i know that i'm doing good i hadn't really was they lost any of this weight that i can tell i feel like i'm losing inches though i really do because my stomach's not swelling if i know a long time ago that all the carbs and sugar is what was swelling me up so bad you know i'm gonna you know glow that's what's doing it wake up but i, I knew i was getting out of control with carbs uh you know, because I was getting work to tolerate a little more, like, you know, slice of toast here, slice of toast there, then bread on a sandwich. But I've cut that out. I haven't had any bread in what year, uh, over two weeks. And I'm really enjoying it. I really feel proud of myself getting back to where I was because I do not miss dumping syndrome. Uh, like I said on one of my um, uh, videos, I think like a week or so ago, that I had uh, went overboard and decided to treat myself because I was being such a good girl all week. Oh, dumb me ate um, some ice cream and uh, I'm talking a little, you know, sliver of cake. And Lord have mercy, whoo! I got sick, but I'm learning, you know, to to not mess up and do that which when was that well last friday i had cake i'm not gonna lie but this was a um they call it uh a mexican cake that's the only proper name i know for it but it's oh my gosh it's so good it's really um so wet it's kind of like a vanilla cake and it had like a you know really light uh like a cool whip uh topping and um, it has some sort of a special 
cream type something poured in it and it's really really good and it's not over sweet because i'd ate a piece of it and i didn't dump i really got the satisfaction but you know i didn't feel deprived so uh, i was good to go but i do find myself at times you know looking like when i'm in the store or whatever i'll look at you know some of my used to be things and i'm like go oh, you can do better than this walk away walk away fat girl so that's what I did, and I'm trying to take a little more pride in myself. Um, yesterday, I decided uh, to put on full makeup, which I did. Turned out really pretty, I thought, except foundation was a little dark. Um, some of my niece had gave me. So what I did is I took a picture of it, so I remember what it is. I can't remember Jack Squat. So I took a picture of it and went to uh, Walmart to find something in the in the same brand. Um, Pretty much the same product, but, you know, lighter, um, uh, what do they call it, lighter tone or whatever. Well, I've seen it. I've got a lighter one, and I got to looking around, and I looked at this little chart, and I see one that was for um, aging, people's aging stuff. I thought, hmm. So I found a beautiful color in that, and I thought, you know, if it pulled out some of these wrinkles, maybe it's got little rubber bands in it, you know, pull that skin back, but, um, yeah, I'm used to be for years and years i didn't look my age i didn't feel old uh well yeah i did feel old let me, let me back up but now i feel awesome on the inside but my outside i don't feel reflects how i feel on the inside i never did feel like uh uh so much an adult because i still like to get outside and you know play with my kids like um We'll shoot some hoops, you know, playing basketball, and I'm teaching my son about playing uh, softball and baseball, which is a lot of fun. I enjoy that because that's something I know about. Uh, when I did the soccer thing, I knew nothing about soccer. I still enjoyed it, but with the uh, the baseball, I know with softball because I used to be a, a softball coach when I was in a job corps in Marion, Virginia, and I really enjoyed that. Um, so softball is one of my passions uh, of course my son wants to play the opposite baseball he wants to be a boy but that's okay I mean, that's okay with me uh, and I'm so glad that I've kind of got back on track as far as my water and my vitamins I feel so much better y'all and I'm taking that dissolvable uh, B12 under the tongue and that's really helped a lot as far as my energy level I mean it's a great level um, if you notice how dark my glasses are, well, you can tell by the wall I'm outside. But it's supposed to be pretty here today. It's supposed to be like 69. Of course, I'm in the south. Uh, not as far south as Jody Joe, but uh, I'm in uh, near Atlanta, Georgia. And um, I love Georgia, y'all. Oh, my gosh. I love Georgia. Uh, uh, West Virginia was my home state. I didn't. I grew up there since I was eight until I was 26. Until my mom passed away. But um, that's about it. Uh, I've i been weighing, and when my weight fluctuates, I don't touch it. Cause the other day my weight was down, which I was happy. So I'll take that. Uh, I weighed this morning about 2:30 in the morning, and uh, you know nobody's uh, you know gonna see a big difference at that time of the morning. Okay, well, I'm gonna jump off here. I just want to get on, say howdy. Um, I'm feeling good. Thank you, Lord. Feeling good. But you know, y'all, if, if you're having a bad day and stuff, just don't give up. Uh, find somebody to talk to. Which, I have my sisters. I'm talking to them, or my niece, Ashley. And she watches my videos a lot. Uh, I love that child. That's not, uh, one of the closest children that I ever got to see growing up. And uh, she never did get on my nerves. Not ever. I think, hmm, but I loved a kid to death. Okay, well, she's a mom yourself now, so pay back. Okay, well, y'all have an awesome day, and I'll talk to you later. Love you. Bye.